Okay, now in order to create an application that will run on the Android emulator, we have to get Java. So let me just, uh, I'm going to close all this out for now. Let me close Android. And we'll go to developers.sun.com forward slash downloads. And we want to go to the Java SE, and we want the Java SE JDK. And you'll notice uh, several different downloads here. What we want is the JDK, the Java SE Development Kit. Okay, so let's click Download. Now, in this case, it doesn't really matter where you download it, uh, as long as you know where it's at, so we can run it. Make sure you select your operating system okay I'm just gonna go ahead and right click this and just to keep everything like I've been doing I'm gonna save it to my desktop and as you can see that's about 73 megs here so it'll take a few minutes I'm gonna pause and come back Okay, the uh, download's been completed. Let me close this, close the window. I'm going to go ahead and run it. Now, you don't need to choose any specific directory. You can let the uh, Java de development kit install in, in the default directory that it wants to. And I will just go ahead and accept this. Just click the default, so I'll go next. And let it install. It'll take a few minutes. Okay, once all the uh, files extract themselves, it'll ask for a destination folder. I just leave the defaults and click Next. By the way, I, I went ahead and fast-forwarded that, so it might have took you several minutes. It appeared to go quickly for me and I'm gonna go ahead and pause it one more time while it finishes installing okay I just click finish okay and it might jump you over to the uh, Java website like it did me let's close that out okay so that completes the installation of Java now in the next video we're going to install a program called Eclipse which is going to help us to do some application development.